Hi, boys and germs. So, here we are. Today we're making the Harley Quinn baseball bat from the animated series. So you're gonna need some Sharpies. You're gonna need some red and black, of course. Um, some masking tape. You're also gonna need some Maj Podge, of course, which is awesome, which is awesome for all arts and crafts. Some black paint. Also some red paint. And of course, you're gonna need your paint brushes and everything else. And a baseball bat, because you know, you can't do some smashing without a baseball bat. So we're gonna start off by Placing where we're gonna put the tape. I what I did was I did an underlayer of red, so in case you know the tape ever tears or anything, there's still gonna be the red underneath. Um, this is pretty much just a base coat um, on the bottom layer of red that I did. Um, so you see me lining up the identifiers, and then also I'm painting in the red, which is a fun little process. Oh yeah. So this is what the bat sort of looks like right now. Um, now I'm trying to do the black on the handle. With the diamonds, I sort of just won it. I <laughs> just did diamonds because as you can see, I wear the Harley Quinn outfit almost every day. So the diamonds are just there. Um, I'm used to making the diamonds. So I also did the sketch of the diamonds onto the bat. So I have a pretty much a traceable diamond on the bat itself. I'm finishing up the end here, which you can see here. Um, now, I love this process. I love the bat itself so far, what it's turning out to look like. Um, so with the diamonds, I cut them out and I was able to cut them out because I'm going to pretty much trace over the lines of the diamonds. Um, and also I'm going to put them over just to make sure I have a good like copy of the diamonds that I'm going to be able to paint over. Um, so, yeah. No, as you can see, the diamonds, I really just won it. Um, so they're about the size of my palm, honestly, or the size of the ones on my tattoo. Um, yeah, I'm diamonds all around, diamonds everywhere. Diamonds are our boys' best friends too. <laughs> so now, as you can see, I started coloring in the diamonds um, and I also did some black on the bat itself. Um, yeah, I skipped some scraps. <laughs> Um, but the black is pretty much the easiest part because we're going to more focus on the diamonds and the star itself. As you can see, I did trace out the star and I also did a outline of the star and the outline of the diamonds that I'm going to place onto the bat. With the star, um, what I did is I put a little tape on the star itself in the center so I can have it at least on the bat while I'm painting as a guide on where... I didn't want to put the black paint on. Um, so I did the same stuff that I did with the diamonds and I sketched them out um, onto the bat itself. So I had a traceable thing that I can copy while I'm doing it on the bat. Um, so I went back to the diamonds, <laughs> a little bit of paint on my finger. Um, I went back to the diamonds to focus more on them and making sure they are perfecto for smashing, of course. Um, so yeah. Now the process of the bat all together, it did take me about five hours. Now, as you can see here, I'm working on the star now. You can see the black marker where I placed, uh, where I can trace over with the paint on the star, um, which I thought was actually a really helpful idea um, that I was able to do that um, because it made it a little easier and all I did was use the black marker. So it was perfect when I put the black right underneath um, to edge it out perfectly. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of ums in this, as you can see. This is my first cosplay tutorial, so this is fun. We're all doing this together. Um, because lately, I've been doing all my Harley Quinn things on my own. I also have some skates that I'm going to show off. Because there's going to be a lot of Harley Quinn content coming to this YouTube page. Um, so be ready, because Harley Quinn is definitely going to be taking over this YouTube page, as you can see here. Um, which is a long story, which I'm also going to share in one of my next videos. Um, also, I have a few projects that I'm going to talk about in a video coming up. Or you guys can also follow me on TikTok at Louis. I mean Louis M. Benitez. I'll have the link in my bio, of course, and I'm going to have the link in the comments. I mean, not in the comments, in the information of the video itself. So now, as you can see here, I'm doing a black coat. I'm really getting over the black coat now um, because I pretty much did finish the diamonds, and the star is pretty much painted in. The black coat is pretty much the easiest part, but it's honestly, I would do a few layers. I did do about two to three layers of the black. Um, so yeah, of course, this is going to be a fun, you know, Harley Quinn moment when the bat is finished. 
Um, as you can see here, I'm working again on the diamonds because I'm trying to make sure they are perfect. Um, I did have a little bit of a mess up with one of the diamonds, making it a little bigger than I expected it to be. But hey, you know, the black paint definitely was able to reshape that diamond the size I wanted it to be. Now, the reason why I'm doing the animated series bat is because I'm loving the animated series. I love what they're doing with it. It's great DC Universe, DC, HBO Max now actually. <laughs> um, but this is what the bat is starting to finish with the product. I did do the tape, but I did forget to record me placing the tape on. But there you go, boys and germs. Here's your Harley Quinn baseball bat. Now let's get to smashing. Danger, danger. Uh-huh, uh-huh. 